Hello, this is Crunstar, and today I am looking at Phrase Box by Venom Mode. Venom, Ven Venom Mode. Uh, people up here. What this is is a pretty cool little uh, arpe 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 arpeggiator. Uh, let me say that a couple of more times. Arp, arp, arp. Anyways, uh, what this does is this takes chords and makes or tries to mix melodies from them. Uh, not your typical arpeggiator. Uh, arpeggiators. Thank you for that. Arpeggiators uh, normally don't have the the uh, they're they're kind of normally tended to. I can I can think of maybe two or three uh, like cream and stuff like that that come with a sequencer. Um, this is kind of the same old. Most arpeggiators, when you get down to it, has either an up down uh, or arpeggiated up, arpeggiated down, up down, or random. You really don't have any control over what you're doing. Uh, this one, you're, you're kind of doing the, uh, uh, songwriting 101 type of melody creation. You're taking the chords that you have and you're creating melodies from them, or you're, you're creating a phrase or, uh, anything else. And it's got a real couple of wild features going on. So let, let's get this started. I got Scalar in the back to help me with some chords and we're going to probably go into something. Uh, let's, let's use lo-fi-ish. Um, we got... Um, G major seven, a, a, a minor seven, and let's try that one, right? So, as you can tell, this thing's already spinning when it's playing the chord. So, if I want to play the first one out there, I, I just select that, and I hear a sound when it plays, right? And so, if I want to play the this one, maybe this one. This one, if it's if it's there, it'll play the first uh, first uh, um, note of the chord, second note, third chord, fourth chord, right? So majorly, if, if there's going to be a, a six, I mean a sixth note of the chord, if there's going to be like six, it's probably not going to play it. So um, we can we can remove those. Um, also, you got play all of them, play high, play low, first fours. Uh, quiet, loud, fix, random. Uh, then we could do like random over here, and then so now play it again. If you're stuck with uh, trying to come up with something, they have presets that that do different things. This preset offers pinch pin modulation, so you got velocity, transpose, octaves, uh, chance of it playing. So if you want, not want to play it all the time, uh, this has pinch pin modulation, and then you can mess with the mod wheel. So that's what these these things are doing here. Um, so basically, there's a lot of features on this one. Um, most of the time, what I do is I, I just go into the, this generation part of it. Uh, you can you can ge you can have it auto generate stuff so you can mess with the note like what the velocity chances are what if you want to chance transpose it up and down and what the chances octaves and that stuff like that and if I remember right there we go
Okay, I had kind of a kick behind it to give some sort of context, uh, and then changed up the the chord uh, sequence or progression so we can get a little bit difference. kinds of uh, fun and hijinks can be had. Uh, the reason why I wanted to demonstrate this today is uh, I, I noticed that it was on sale by one of the plugin sites. Uh, so if, in case you saw it and you wanted to, to know about it or you wanted to see a newer video about it, uh, give it a chance and, and show some of the features on it. Uh, it's got a ton of features for a random generation of phrases and stuff like that. Very cool little program. I've had it for... Uh, 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 probably about a couple of years. Um, it, it, uh, it does a lot for, for kind of cool stuff. So what I like to do is I like to hook it up with other random generation things, kind of like Scalar or, um, I had, I had a video a while ago on, I think it's this Scalar and then, uh, Melody, um, sauce to, to, to give some random, random chords playing at random times and then trying to couple with new phrases, uh, using these random chords. Uh, so I loved I loved the the, span, the the string along different uh, MIDI tools to to help generate some really wild combinations of of MIDI and sound. Uh, overall, messing with it, I actually like this last one where I ended up. pretty cool uh now i got a nice loop for a, a song starter or some type of i can see that in the build up or i mean uh, after the build up or something in the main section uh where i could you know you go full blast and, and you have something high speed um that would be a kind of a cool little melody to have to to, to have it going um something to think about it could probably take away some you could probably add some but overall, really, really cool starter for something uh, of a song if, you, if you're if you stuck or you want to try something new. Um, overall, pretty cool little application. Hope you liked the video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. I appreciate this. Uh, and I will catch you in the next video.